nuclear deal. The talks have had very considerable progress and the breadth and number of topics has decreased dramatically. Israel is not a party to the agreements and Israel will continue to reserve full freedom of action with no constraints. Potential for an Iran deal factor into uh, supply considerations at this point? If you go back to the uh, implementation of the uh, JCPOA uh, would be the availability of oil, but uh, but I would say that our first and foremost priority um, doing a tour of the library the here and um, talking about the significance of the passage of time. This year, the Academy hired three women to host because it's cheaper than hiring one man. <laughs> to be hosting, representing black women who are standing proud. Yes, and I'm and living out loud. Yes. 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 And I am representing unbearable white women who call the cops when you get a little too loud. Okay. The significance of the passage of time. Can you provide a definition for the word woman? I can't. You can't? N not in okay. this context. So I'm you not a biologist. The meaning of the word woman is so unclear and controversial that you can't give me a definition. So when you think about it, there is great significance to the passage of time. Now, this year we saw a frightening display of how toxic masculinity turns into cruelty towards women and children. Mm. You, damn that Mitch McConnell. I know. I know. What we need to do to lay these wires, what we need to do to create these jobs. And there is such great significance to the passage of time. Nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh. Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith. When we think about a day in the life of our children. U.S. and Europe are trying to stop Russia's bloody conquest of Ukraine, but at the same time, they are relying on Russia to help revive the 2015 nuclear deal with Iran. No wonder Russia feels emboldened to call for even more capitulation from the West. One of the reported demands of the Iranians is that this administration reverse the policy of the last one and remove the IRGC from the list of foreign terrorist organizations. What's the U.S. position on that? Look, there, we are close. Uh, we are making progress, um, but we are. there's still more work to be done, and I'm just not going to negotiate. Closer to three. We're at the Oscars. I mean, this is it. This is a dream come true. I can't even believe it. The, the only thing, the only place I could think of that could be better than this is home. Can you provide a definition for the word woman? Can I provide a definition? Mm -hmm. No. Yeah. I can't. This is so exciting. I just want to congratulate all of you. During a raging pandemic, you made a movie. I mean, really, yeah, give yourselves a hand. That's incredible. You did it. We know that Russia, China, Iran, North Korea, that is your new axis of evil. We cannot trust any of them. And so some people saw this as, you know, a problem, as, as sort of a uh, hypocritical moment. Dr. Uh, Dr. Levine has, has noted that, in fact, there is a difference in terms of who oversees uh, you know, the, the personal care facilities that's under the Department of Human Services. She ran the Department of Health and also noted that it was her mother's decision, that she was perfectly capable of making that decision, and also that uh, in choosing to have Do you people go agree back into that nursing our schools homes. Should teach children that they can choose their gender. Senator, I'm not um, remembering exactly what quote you're um, referencing, but Georgetown Day School is... A, it was in a, a book, in a, and you gave the quote. Okay. Georgetown Day School is a private school yes. um, that... Um, yeah, I, I'm asking, do you agree that schools should teach children that they can choose their gender? Senator... I'm not making comments about All right. what schools can. Do you agree with Justice Ginsburg that there are physical differences between men and women that are enduring? Um, Senator, 
respectfully, I am not familiar with that particular quote or case, okay. so it's hard for me to... Do you interpret Justice Ginsburg's meaning of men and women as male and female? Again, because I don't know the case, I don't know how I interpret it. I need to read the whole okay. thing. Okay. Uh, can you provide a definition for the word woman? Great night uh, tonight. Can and I for you people in Florida, yeah. we're going to have a gay night. I can't. Gay, gay, you can't? Oh, all the bravery. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's, that, was a, that was a nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh. Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. <laughs> Did Wow, dude. Yeah. It was a G.I. Jane jump. Keep my wife's name out your fucking mouth. I'm going to, okay? Later, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it, all right? <laughs> That was a nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh. Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. Keep my wife's name out your fucking mouth. Wow, dude. Yeah. It was a G.I. Jane jump. Keep my wife's name out your fucking I'm going to, okay? Nice one, okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh, Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith is caring for the possibility that this could end in how so? Sure, there are timelines, including, I think, upcoming in April on when it's continues to be reconsidered. And those discussions happen among the health experts from the CDC uh, and other, uh, other medical experts within the administration. And you always have to prepare because if they'd make that decision, there would be an implementation that uh, would be in part led by the Department of Homeland Security and others uh, that you have to plan for. Include in preparing for a large influx of migrants at the border specifically. Well, uh, certainly that would be part of it. Um, if uh, if uh, if if and when um, the uh, CDC makes that determination.